Conformity is going along with the group, modeling your responses after what the group is doing, doing exactly what the crowd, what everybody else is performing. People today are generally considered more self-aware and sophisticated about the effects of social influence. But are they less subject to conformity? Dr. Pratkanis decided to find out. There will be a stimulus line over here on your left-hand side. And all you'll need to do is to pick which of these lines is the same as the stimulus line. And we'll go around in order. And all you need to do is state the number. We'll start with subject number one. What is your response? Two. Subject number two. Two. Subject number... On the first two trials, the Confederates matched the stimulus line to the standard line, giving the right answer. Five. Two. Subject number six. Two. Subject number seven. Two. On the third trial and thereafter, the Confederates One. give the obviously incorrect response. One. Subject three. One. Subject four. One. Subject five. One. Subject six. Two. Subject seven. One. Subject one. Two. Subject two. Two. Subject three. As this subject hears the rest of the group subject give the wrong answer, two. he initially resists subject the influence five. of group pressure. Subject six. One. Subject Most seven. subjects start out defying the group, but after repeated trials, many of them begin to conform. Two. Subject four. Two. Subject five. Two. Subject six. Two. Subject seven. Two. Subject number four, what is your response? One. Subject number five. One. Subject number six, your turn. One. Their voices may drop. They may know they're giving the wrong answers. But they eventually give in. Two. Subject number six. Two. Fifty years later, we can set up that same exact experiment and get nearly the same exact results as Solomon Ash. We found that the majority of subjects in our experiment would conform at least once. That is, they would go along with the Confederates when they picked the wrong answer at least once. The majority of the subjects. So why do people conform when they know that they're doing or saying something that is inconsistent with objective reality? Two. Subject seven. Two. The group takes on a total reality. You're into that reality. There's no outside. This is what the group is saying. This is what the reality is that they're creating. And so you're in that and you see that and the pressures come on you and so you conform. 